We'll guide you through how to make a logo in Canva. If you find this useful, then consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, come to Canva. Now there are some different ways you can go and make logos, so let's get started. First of all though, click on the search and go and type in logo like so, and go and choose the 500 by 500 option here. So what we're gonna be focused on this video is creating a logo from blank, but there are also loads of templates which are worth checking out. Browse through here and when you see one you like, you can go and click on it and click on customize this template over to the right. And then what you can do is go and type in the text you want to go and use. You may need to go and resize things like the text box and also just move the elements so they all fit. But to go and create one from blank, go and click on the button and here we are. So what you first want to do is come to text and I like to go and add some text. So you can scroll through here and go and see loads of different font combinations you could go and use. So for example, I could click on this one here and then what you can do is once again, double click and type in what you want it to say. Make the text a bit bigger. And then what you could do is add a little background here as well. So we can come into elements, we can go and grab a circle and then what you can do is resize it. Change the color by clicking on the color in the top left and choose one which you think will look good. Then you can right click on it and click on layer and go and click on send backwards. And there we go. Of course, you can go and make adjustments as well to get it looking how you want it to. The next example I want to show you is if we come to text on the left here and you want to go and search for a font called Blanker. So you can go and type that in like so, click on it. This font looks really cool. I'll just go and resize it. And what you can also do is come to elements. And what you could do is go and type in line, for example, and you can click on it to go and add it. Now this is white, so it's hard to see, but if we right click on it, hover over layer and click on bring forward, you can then see it will go over the text, which is quite cool. And of course you can then go and adjust it to your liking. And there are loads of other lines you can go and check out and do similar things with. A simple design I like doing is coming to text then what you want to do is go and just choose a bold font. So I'll click on add a heading. You can then go and type in a character. So I'll go and add in T for example. And what I'll do is go and change the color to white as we'll go and need it, that color shortly. Now come over to the left into elements, go and search for circle and grab one. Then what you want to do is with the circle is go and click on the color in the top left. You could choose a solid color or a gradient, which is what I like to do. And you can then go and resize it. Now go and grab your text layer, which of course is just behind it and you want to go and right click on that, hover over layer and click on bring to front. Then what you can do is go and place it over the circle. You may want to go and resize it a bit. That's what I like to do. So it sort of cuts out the edges. So there we go guys, there are just a few examples of how you can go and create logos in Canva. Of course, with this example here as well, you could go and change the size of the shape and use different fonts as well.